Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the Dorbin number 188D. This is a saddle type threshold, and the 188 is representative of the fact that it is a saddle type threshold. It also means, the 188 anyway, means that dimensionally this threshold is 8 inch wide and a half inch tall. Okay, half inch tall. The D in the part number stands for what Dorbin calls dark brown, and that is exactly what the finish is. This, of course, is just a sample piece, just a short little cutoff piece, quite frankly, that we're using for the purposes of this video. This is available in all of the common sizes, two foot to eight foot, and this one indeed started out life as an eight foot piece, and you can see that jagged cut that's there. Uh, which leads me to say that if you have need for a custom length, by all means, let us know by ordering the next longest piece or pieces and simply indicate in the comment field what length you'd like for us to cut the material back to. The reasoning is that's a pretty common dimension from the edge of the threshold, about four inch, something in that range. This is a little bit less, but three or four inch. If you were to take a, you know, a 48 inch piece and cut it down to 42 inch, well, you'd eliminate that first soldier stack of screws there, and because it's 8 inch wide, you're going to have two. You run the risk of getting a lousy cut, because it's so wide that your tool may not be able to cut it without having to flip it over. Uh, and then, of course, having to drill and countersink new holes, and sometimes that's as much of a challenge as anything else. You want the holes to be dimpled from the factory, because that allows the included 10 by inch and a half or so flat head uh, screws to seat properly into the countersink and that will th that's important because it allows the threshold to stay in position much better and not fall susceptible to all those lateral forces when you've got a screw properly seated into the countersink. So if you ordered a custom length we'd not only cut it to length but locate those countersinks at the proper distance from the edge and the proper center to center as well. Now where a threshold like this is going to be used, lots of places. Eight inch is not that uncommon. Uh, if you were doing like maybe a deeper than standard aluminum frame, like a six and nine sixteenths, that could be a standard size. Uh, and you were going over a sill to an interior sort of application and you simply needed to span, you know, an eight inch worked for you because you might have cement block with a face brick sort of construction and a deeper frame would make more sense because you've got a deeper threshold would make more sense because you've got a deeper frame. People will also take and literally cope the end of the threshold to match the profile of a smaller frame because they literally want the face of this to run all the way to the wall on both sides. You might do that for lots of reasons to dress up the bottom of the area but also to help protect the bottom of the frame uh, might give a more consistent sort of look when the frame is just coming out of the threshold. Another reason that people will use a wide saddle type like this is because they might need to achieve an offset saddle or a half saddle, but they might need it a very unusual size, like seven and an eighth of an inch. Well, there is no such thing as a half saddle, but you could take an eight inch and rip that down on the table saw and custom make your own half saddle or offset threshold where you might be going from a sill to an interior flooring condition where you've got a half inch sort of profile. People will do that a lot as well. Uh, so lots of reasons why you might use this. Why it might serve your purpose doesn't really matter, but if eight by half works for you, then great, here it is. Okay. The name Dorbin is synonymous with uh, weather stripping. They have been in business for sure since the 1930s. Um, and I'm partial to Dorbin, and it's not only because of a very long-standing relationship with them, but they're very good at what they do. They have a relatively petite footprint of what they sell. They focus in on just primarily commercial weather stripping thresholds, door sweeps, perimeter gasketing, uh, material made of aluminum and architectural bronze, even a little bit of stainless. But they also have a nice complementary offering of uh, double hung wood window weather stripping as well that's made in both zinc and bronze 
and they'll have bronze while they're stripping for doors too. There's a link below this video to the manufacturer's page where you can pull up the full line Dorbin catalog uh, and review their entire product line. If you're looking for a good quality product, and what I mean by that is this 188D, it's a, it's a generous extrusion thickness, and it's a nice finish as well on there. Uh, if you're looking for good quality, industry leading ship times, decent value for the dollar, Dorbin is definitely a name that you should consider. If there's anything that we can help you with with the Dorbin 188D, it's also available in the A finish, which is just mill finish aluminum, or any other Dorbin product, please feel free to reach out to us. Thank you.